You can use a remote control device like a Bluetooth or MIDI foot switch, a handheld Bluetooth switch, or a programmable button on a MIDI keyboard to trigger actions in BandHelper. Go to the Settings Remote Control page and browse the list of actions. Then click one and choose the type of message that your remote control device will send. Then select the exact message you want to use to trigger this action. If you want, you can assign more than one action to the same remote control message. So for example, you could start the tempo and start auto-scrolling from a single foot switch button. Remote control actions only work when viewing a set list or a smart list. So let's navigate to the set lists and select one. And now I can press my foot switch to trigger the actions I set. If you're having trouble setting up remote control, you can click the foot switch icon in the top toolbar to see an activity log. This will show incoming messages received and might show additional info about what BandHelper is doing with the messages. By the way, most Bluetooth foot switches act like a text keyboard, so if you want to edit some text in the app while the foot switch is connected, the on-screen keyboard might not appear. Some foot switches have a button you can press to force the on-screen keyboard to appear. If yours doesn't, you'll have to turn off the foot switch to do your editing and then turn it on again.